Hello friends, how's it going? Today I have this awesome Ultra Prism Elite Trainer box to open for you. This was actually filmed in January 2019. I'm going through my backlog right now and this video also does not have my normal audio, so sorry about that. But the polls are still fun, so let's get into it. So of course on the outside wrapping we've got all of the really cool pack arts from the Ultra Prism set. I haven't opened a lot of Ultra Prism, so it's really cool to see these all blown up and awesome. As with all Elite Trainer boxes, we get a player's guide. Mine got a little folded in the factory it looks like and oh oh there's a little insert here for the Pokemon Center very cool so you can see all the fun stuff at the PokemonCenter.com you can only order if you live in the US though so sorry to all the non-US peeps but here's the pretty page that I always like to look for with all the gold and of course the Solgaleo GX which I'm really looking forward to hopefully pulling someday in my life next up we have the actual Elite Trainer box with our Dusk Main Necrozma on it very very cool with the black and yellow combo we've got the set logo on the top and also on either side and then another Dusk Main Necrozma on the other side here to go with the box we also get four dividers one side of each divider has this uh, zoomed out little shattered glass picture and then the other side is a zoomed in just a cool picture of Dusk Man Necrozma. With that same zoomed out design, we also get some really sweet sleeves to allow you to build more decks. It also comes with a lot of energy cards, a poison and burn and GX marker for gameplay, and some dice for damage counters and coin flipping when you're playing the game. Very cool stuff here with the set logo on them. And then for our super exciting mid event, we've got eight packs of Ultra Prism goodness, two of each pack art, so that is really sweet and symmetrical. So we're gonna start off with our Dawn Wings Necrozma. I always mess up the names of those two guys. I really just want to say Solgaleo and Lunala, but I know it's fused with Necrozma and all that goodness from Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. So here we go with our first pack. We've got a uh, Darkness Energy, a Rotom, a Unit Energy, Perugly, a Lolan Sandshrew, a Lolan Bullpix. We've got a Bronzor, a Dewpider, Piplup, an Infernape reverse rare that is really cool I, I was almost going to say something stupid so this is awesome i really love the art here very very cool and then our rare is a type null all right i always like seeing type null he's one of my favorites from that generation but you don't really see a lot of stuff of him in the u.s anyway i know there was like a a Sylvalian type null uh, promotion at the Pokemon centers in Japan when uh, Gladion was a really popular character when Sun and Moon first came out, but nothing in the States. So we've got another Darkness Energy, another Rotom, Mount Coronet, Hunchcrow, Eevee, Alolan Vulpix, Stunky, Young Goose. Oh gosh, I'm having a lot of problems today. We've got a Roselia, a Magnemite Reverse, and our rare is a Mo Rotom non hollow I do love the Rotoms in this set. I think I have all of them now, though. Especially I have Mo Rotom. I think I have multiples of that one. But that is okay, because I do love Rotom. Uh, I still remember after I was playing Diamond and Pearl, I realized that Rotom was motor backwards, and it like blew my mind. It's it's one of the cooler Pokemon names out there for sure. Uh, up there with, with Ekans. So we've got an Electric Energy, a Cosmoa, Volkner, Bronzong, Stunky, Young Goose, Roselia, Cosmog, a Turtwing, an Eevee Reverse, I love this Eevee, and then a rare is a Toxicroak non-hollow, very cool looking and menacing Toxicroak. So I think we're, we're halfway through when we open this one, so I'm hoping for some sparkly stuff. We have not seen very much sparkle at all in this opening except for Reverse Hollows, so... We're, we're really hoping for something cool, like maybe a Prism Star is always very, very nice. So here we go, we start off with a Fire Energy, an Unidentified Fossil, Shieldon, Luxio, Skroopy, Young Goose, Drooby, Piplup, Snover, a Young Goose Reverse, and then a Rare is an Alolan Sand Slash non hollow oh man So we're on to our Giratina Origin Form packs now. I'm really hoping to see a Giratina Origin Form in Pokemon Go pretty soon. I know uh, they had it in the trailer for, I think it was for Trainer Battles, uh, but but we haven't actually seen it in the game. We've only seen the normal altered form or whatever it's called. So uh, I always, I used to call it like another form because I knew it started with an A, but I'm pretty sure it's altered form. I think that's the official one. So we've got a Perugly reverse and then a rare is a Licky Licky. I don't think I have this card, so that's pretty sweet to see. I'm, I'm getting a large pile, so hold on a sec. All right, so I got my mess cleaned up and now we're on to our second Giratina Origin form pack. I'm really hoping that uh, with the, the Switch Pokemon games being developed that they're they're working on a, a remake of Gen 4 on the side. I know everybody wants one real bad, so I feel like if, if they know what's good for them, they'll make one. So we've got a Fire Energy that's out of focus. Oh gosh, okay, there we go. We've got a Monferno, a Gabite, Pokemon Fan Club, Pachirisu, Yanma, Murkrow, oh, We've got an Eevee and a Lolan Vulpix. I cannot hold cards today. A Cosmo Reverse and then a rare. Oh, 
wow, we got a Looker full art. That is so great. I love Looker in Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum. He's such an interesting character, and you get to see him again in various later games, too, as part of the international police. So that is really awesome, and he's eating a Malasada there. That is so cool to have finally in my collection. The, the full art supporters are really, really great. There's a lot of really cool uh, trainer characters in the series that they really shine on those supporter cards for sure. So we're on to our second to last pack of this entire opening. We do have a full art now, but honestly, we haven't really gotten much at all in terms of like shiny things. So we're hoping for something very good in these last few packs. So here we go forward to the front. We've got a Psychic Energy, a Looker Whistle, Gabite, Drifflim, Roselia, Gibble, Electabuzz, Chimchar, Pachirisu, a Chimchar Reverse, and a rare- Oh wow, we got a Sylvali GX, jeez! So one after another, very cool cards. Oh man, I love Sylvali so much. He is such a cool Pokemon. Very, very awesome to get all sorts of cards of this Pokemon and its evolution like, because we did get a ty Type Null earlier. So we've got our last pack of the opening. I am still hoping for a last pack magic, but we did get some really cool stuff in the last couple of packs that we opened. So here we go with our last pack. Four to the front, and we've got a Fairy Energy, a Grottle, Fire Memory, Bronzong, Skroopy, Stunky, Young Goose, Magmar, a little Diglett, a Lucario Reverse Rare, that's pretty sweet, and our final rare is a Garchomp non-holo. Alright, I love seeing that. So all in all, we got some pretty sweet cards in this opening. We've got an Infernape Reverse Rare, a Lucario Reverse Rare, very awesome for that precognitive aura, and then we've got a Sylvali GX, very, very cool looking, I really love the artwork on this card, and then a Looker Full Art, definitely on my high wants list for sure for this set. So I will give you guys an Ultra Prism Booster Code to celebrate, comment, let us know what you got, so that that we know that you've taken it. So thanks for watching everybody, and I'll catch you all on the flip side.